Leah. Oh, God, not again. <laughs> All right. First moment I saw you, I knew you were the one. I told my friends that if I got the chance to meet you, I wouldn't let you go. Chris, I stand before you today as your wife and life partner. I can't believe it was five years ago in April when I made the most random decision of my life to meet you out for drinks. As it turns out, that spur of the moment decision was the best decision I've ever made because it led me here to you. In getting to know Leah and Chris, I asked them to tell me more about themselves and their relationship. I knew I was in love with Leah, Chris said, when I couldn't stop thinking about her or wanting to be with her. Leah said, every weekend we would spend a full 72 hours together and each time Chris had to leave to go back to his house, I felt like a part of me was leaving with him. That's when I knew I was in love. I am so madly in love with you. I love your smile, your laugh, how deeply you care for the people you love, how you pace back and forth around the house when you're on the phone, <laughs> and all the rest of the idiosyncrasies that make you who you are. You are the most beautiful person inside and out. You're my best friend, and I can't imagine my life without you. I love you so much, and I promise to love you on your good days and your bad days. I promise to be patient with you. I promise to continue being faithful to you, to be open and honest with you, to laugh with you. I promise to keep an open heart and an open mind. To be a great husband to you. And a great father to our daughter. Today I choose you and I'll continue to choose you without any fear or doubts. You have all my trust and all my love. You are my person, the love of my life, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you. I'm so excited for this next chapter in our lives. You've already been the most amazing husband, and I know you're going to be the most amazing dad. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Lee and Chris have both written something special to each other and they don't know what the other's written. Chris, this is what Lee has written to you. Chris, you never have to walk through this life on your own. I will always be there for you, by your side, to listen, to laugh, to cry, and to love you forever. And Leah, this is what Chris has written to you. Leah, I want you to know that I am so proud of you for everything you've accomplished. And I know you will be an amazing mother to our daughter. Leah, I give you these rings. As a symbol of my love. And my devotion. For these rings, I give you my life. Destiny is a mysterious thing. No matter where you go or what you do, you can't avoid it. And no matter how hard you try, even putting forth your greatest effort, you can't force it to happen before it's time. The occasion we've witnessed today is the destiny of two souls. There is not a force in the universe that could have kept you both apart. And there is nothing you could have done to come together sooner. Each of you had to live your lives to this point, 
lives that were stepping stones that have led to this moment in time, this uniting of hearts and minds that shall be for always and forever. May the magic of your love continue to grow, and may you know nothing but happiness from this day forward. And now, having witnessed the vows you've just made to each other, surrounded by your love and your loved ones, I am honored to pronounce you husband and wife. You may seal your vows with a kiss. So first, I would like to talk to Chris. As parents, you know, all we ever wanted for Leah was for someone to love her as much as we do. And Chris, you have not only shown that on numerous occasions. In fact, we got a bonus. You also love us. <laughs> And that's a really big deal for us. And we love you even more, Chris. You know, I, I firmly believe that for every person, there's a special person that was meant to be. In Chris and Leah's case, they found their true love. The first time I met Leah and Chris together, it genuinely brought tears to my eyes. I realized in that moment that she had truly met her person. Leah, you're not only beautiful and intelligent and have the heart of an angel, and you're the entire package, and I'm so happy that Chris found you. Christopher, you continue to impress me with your love and admiration for Leah. And now I can't imagine her with anyone else. You are a brother to me. And I'm so glad to have you part of the family. I just love you so much. And I'm so proud of you. You're great, Leah. And I am so happy. I'm happy that you love my son and that he loves you. And I love you and you're my second daughter. You're my family. And Cherry and Horace, y'all are my family now. We're all one. I don't remember which rapper we wanted to marry back then. <laughs> Someone. But I do remember that she wanted to marry a man like her father. Someone who was loving and caring and protective. It makes me so happy to know that she has met that person. In Chris, we found another son. Someone who's loving, caring, smart, good looking. <laughs> I'm so proud to see the woman you've become. You are the most kind, caring, generous, compassionate, intelligent, wonderful human being. Let's all cheers to my best friend, who is now married to her best friend. Congratulations, I love you both. 